buscamos por todas partes sin nada. Los culeros ya se fueron. That's close. Okay. Looks like they're settling down over there. Drone is airborne. Roger that. Move it. Ready to engage. Target is down. Hang back, they see you. I got it, I'll fly. Good to go. The cartel's operating a coca paste lab inside a converted fish processing plant in Okoro. Find the lab and shut it down. Bye. Narco, next to the container, see?
target mark. Keep an eye on your background. They're gonna be on top of us in another few seconds. What do we do? Alarm over here. Got another tango. Good Mexican. Grenade, watch out! Grenade, grenade! up on the objective. Get ready. We need to get inside and destroy their mixing bats and ovens. Taking those out will shut the place down for months. Frag out. Come in here to Culeros. Frag out. Get some. Frag out. Come in here to Culeros. Place destroyed. El Emisario better pull his head out of his ass, or pretty soon he won't have an operation left to run. Yeah, that's the plan. No man, this is Pat Katari. The damage you've done in Okoto has made El Emisario very nervous. He's terrified of what El Yayo will think when he finds out how much production capacity has been lost. Sounds good so far. To make up the difference, El Emisario has ordered his men to take over a hospital in Okoro and convert it into a cocaine lab. Son of a bitch. We must keep the cartel from taking over the hospital. It's vital to the people of Okoro and to my people as well. I have sent a small force to defend the building, but it's not enough. They won't last long without help. Understood. Tell your people we're on the way. <laughs> Need a copter. Clear over here. Okay, I can fast travel. The drone is up. Oh, look at that. 
Lily, hey pretty Lily. You're such a good girl. Oh, you're my pretty girl. Oh, you're my pretty girl. Watch out, Lily. Okay, watch out. Oh, Lily. But you wanna play? Okay. Where is that oh, right there? Let's see. Fast jump over there. Do you got a party? All right, I'll take you party. Okay, come on, let's go play. Are you a happy dog? Uh, yeah, where's my controller? Oh, there it is. Okay, so so I need to El Emissario is staging an attack on a local hospital, and Pakatari needs help to defend it. It's your call, but helping Katari now will buy us a lot of support later on. Hang on, I'll drive. The good or the evil that wins. Let's roll. Accept the reality of this battle, Metamanos. Cultivate the good and benevolent half of your heart so that it will conquer the evil. But keep that evil half alive. Just as God gave Lucifer his own kingdom. Let your evil reign in its prison. Because you never know when you will need your heart to be ruthless.
up in the hospital now. Doesn't look like El Amisario's made his move yet. Let's find the Rebel CO and tell him we're here. Right behind you, boss. Damn it. Oh, that's a little better. That's better. A little bit. I wonder if it even matters if I have it. I am not. Get tal, compas? You've come just in time. As scouts tell me, the Misarios men are on their way. How's it looking here? We've sent away as many doctors and patients as we could. Plus a few trucks loaded with medicines and vaccines. That way, if the hospital is lost, at least there will be something left for the sick and injured. Yeah, pues. My daughter was born in this hospital. Now here I am, carajo, defending it from cartel thugs who want to turn it into one of their damned cocaine labs. Is nothing sacred to these people? Nothing but death, Kumpa. That's why we're here. El Amisario's men can hit the place at any moment. 
We need to get dug in tight before the shooting starts. Roger that. We got rebels throwing down with the cartel. What's our play? We rattled somebody's cage. Frag out. Get some. Engaging hostiles. Frag. What is my fucking controller doing that? Oh, you know what it is? I bet you I know what the fuck it is. Lara, Damn, I'm out. This is Bowman. Looks like you really stirred the shit in Okoro. Word of your attacks has got back to El Sueño and he's out for blood. El Yayo's trying to cover for his grandson, but he's caught between a rock and a hard place. El Sueño is demanding an explanation from El Emisario, and El Yayo's trying to come up with a solution that keeps his grandson alive. What's this do for us? El Yayo's been on the phone with El Emisario for most of the day, and we've been able to triangulate his position. This is our chance. El Emisario's twisting in the wind. We bring him in now, he'll give us everything he knows. Give us the location, we'll take care of it. All tangles are down, area's secure. You guys all good? Damn, I love this job. Somebody want to explain to me why we're extracting El Emisario. We know he only got where he is now because of his granddad. It ain't like he... Buckle up, 
Koro's a mess, and Suenyo is calling for El Emisario's head. Not even El Yeyo can protect him now. Track down El Emisario and bring him in. Let's see if he's willing to cut a deal. We must keep in balance and harmony with the cosmos. And that is why I am happy that our country is working with Santa Blanca. This is not the same secular industrialization that the gringos and their CIA have tried to force upon us. This Mexican organization, this Latin organization, believes, as I do, that human beings are caretakers of our Earth, guardians of the land. And they believe that with proper management, we can find a way to benefit both man and La Madre Tierra. Santa Blanca is Bolivia's partner in caring for our Earth. This is for the future of Bolivia, compañeros. This is the legacy that we leave the generations to come. Shit got close for a second there. Foreigners working in our country, but that couldn't be further from the truth. This fight with the rebels is nothing less than a battle for the very freedom of Bolivia. The government's supported foreign investment has done much to improve the lives of the average. Fire. And more than that. Copy. I'm engaging takeoffs. The opportunity to make a real go of it, to create a business that will be the best. Bien, camarada. Congratulations on defending the hospital from El Emisario's men. We couldn't have done it without you. Don't mention it, Qatari. Just add it to your bill. There is one more thing. Before El Emisario's men attacked the hospital, one of my people loaded a truck with vaccines and tried to get them to safety. Unfortunately, he was stopped at the unit at checkpoints and the truck was confiscated. It's vital we get those vaccines, Yankee. The truck is at a unit at pace now. I know it's asking much of you, but frankly, there is no one else who can do it. Understood. We'll see what we can do. We got a sniper. Get down. Cover. Get to cover. Took you so long. Coming up on the target area now. Get ready. Bowman can't wait to take her away. I've got cartel Sicarios incoming. Get back to it. Bowman can't wait to take a run at El Amasario. So watch your fire. We need to take him alive. Copy that. I'll be damned. Ladies and gentlemen, El Emisario has left the building. Killed himself rather than face his own grandfather. That's fucked up. I feel like we drove him to it. Come on, man, stop it with that shit. He made a choice. We need to check the body. See if he's got anything on him.
Hey, got a suicide note. Bowman, this is Nomad. We found El Emissario. What happened? He killed himself. Left a note to El Sueño taking the blame for the loss of the labs in Okoro. Guess the shame of failing his grandfather was just too much to take. That little shit. We had El Yayo by the nuts, and now this. Guess he wasn't quite the fuck up we thought he was. He just didn't break the way we expected him to. It happens sometimes. You do this sort of thing a lot? I do whatever it takes to get the job done. Same as you. Innovation versus experience. Technology versus tradition. Youth versus age. La gringa versus el yayo. I had been hoping they would complement each other, but they could not get along. They were too different. I have been producing cocaine this way for years. That's exactly the problem. Our product was so good, the demand was only increasing. We couldn't keep up. I don't care how you do it. Science, tradition, or voodoo. Just make more. Or I'll find someone that can. I'll pilot. Unidad has confiscated a truck full of medicines from the rebels. I want you to take it back and get it to Qatari's people. They'll make sure it's put to good use. A todas las unidades, comiencen el ataque. Get these vaccines to Qatar's wait. We need to get these vaccines to Qatar's people ASAP. Is get inside the outpost, find the truck, and haul ass. Copy that. Eyes on the package. Time to collect. I need to get to a better position. Copy. Target mark. We got a couple of fronts here. There, by the truck. Say the word, boss. Hostile down. Deploying drone. unidades, comiencen el ataque. Los voy a encontrar. I'm moving to position. Moving to a good sight line. Target acquired. Standing by. Say the word. Open fire. That's one tango down. Hemos localizado la última posición conocida del enemigo, pero han desaparecido. Comenzando una nueva búsqueda ahora mismo. ¿En qué dirección se fueron? Take cover!
Enemy killed. Shit balls. Sniper's got us targeted. Damn it! We got tangos, danger close. Hey, a new need that soldier. Right by the mortar. <laughs> Drone is airborne. Target carry Roger, some machine let me guns. get in position. Let me get a good sight line. Target acquired. Good to go. Target down. Fuck, they found a body. unidades, comiencen el ataque. No veo nadie. Roger that, moving. I need a better position. Roger, target acquired. I've got the target. Opening fire. Enemy down. enemigas en posición para mandar ataque solicitando fuego de apoyo por aquí están los gringos Roger let me get in position let me get a good sight line Roger that target marked están en el perímetro caray target marked target down
Enemigos a la vista. Coordinando el ataque. Roger that. Moving. Target I need acquired. a better position. Aquí está neto, I've got the target. Put him in a body bag. A todas las unidades, comiencen el ataque. Damn it, fucked it up. Atari, this is Nomad. We've got the package you asked for. We're delivering it now. Bravo, my friend. Hold up. Get ready. Fire. Roger. Sorry, we got cut off. Okay. Now, where were we? Bravo, my friend. Drive carefully. The glass ampules containing the vaccine are very fragile. Take a turn too quickly and... Uh... I get it. We'll be careful. No matter how. Nice job, Hotshot. Your team's done a number on Santa Blanca's share of the cocaine market, and liberating that hospital and those vaccines saved a lot of innocent lives. Well, we aim to please. The cartel may dial up their efforts to make up for lost revenue. Maybe, but if they're not signing paychecks, they're losing loyalty. You know it. I'll be in touch. Tori, the... This is Nomad. The package has been delivered. It's all yours. Thank you, Kumpa. I'm in your debt. Those vaccines will save many lives. 
Okay, now what? Yes, I did that. But now that he's gone, the farmers in Okor are taking back control of the cane production. It's still small, but they'll get back on their feet. I've got the bike. Just arrived in Agua Verde. Welcome to Narco Paradise. Agua Verde used to be a national park, but Santa Blanca turned it into a place to wine and dine VIPs. Run by this narco junior called Carzida. He brings politicians, judges, and CEOs there for relaxation and cartel sponsored debauchery. What's the play? We need to know who Sueño's making deals with. Carzida must have a guest list somewhere. You get him, you get the names. Understood. We're on it. We got some intel from Bowman on our boy Carzita. Javier Coronel Bayardo, which is a mouthful, so let's call him what his rich friends do. Carzita. He's a Mepi, a Mexican preppy, or a Prepsican if you prefer. His main achievement in life was to win the sperm lottery. Gonzalo Coronel Bayardo, telecom billionaire, is his daddy. Gave Sunny everything. Money, cars, education, BA from Harvard, MBA Wharton Business, D Phil from Oxford to acquire a little sophistication and some good English clothes. Mm. Now he gets his own resort to run. This used to be a national park, but Santa Blanca turned it into an exclusive resort. It's here that Carzita does what Carzita does best, making connections between Santa Blanca and anyone that's anyone. CEOs, politicians, judges, socialites, even celebrities. You know who that is, right? Hint. She just went to rehab for saying something racist. 
What Karzita offers the cartel is more than just business deals. It's a level of corruption we've never seen before. And it's on you to stop it. We cut the connections, we stop the corruption. We're gonna make you back up. Their lieutenants run engaging. I've been wanting one of these. This province is part of the cartel's influence operation, the propaganda machine. We should familiarize ourselves with their M.O. The man at the top is El Cardinal, an excommunicated priest turned Santa Muerta proponent. He's also supposed to be the spiritual advisor to El Sueño. Other guy in the mix is Ramon Feliz. He used to be a legit journalist till he inexplicably started blogging for the cartel. All priests like to hear themselves talk, don't they? But as the saying goes, talk is cheap. El Cardenal knew this was true. His people were barely surviving, and he wanted to do something. He had to help those in need. He didn't care where the support came from. But there were others who thought he was making deals with the devil. He was cast out. He lost his family, his friends. Lo perdió todo. When I found him, he was a broken man. I brought him into Santa Blanca to preach the truth of the new faith. For we are wed to death from the moment we are born, and we must come to love her more than we love our lives. Sacred and blessed death, the goddess of darkness can free you from sickness and evil. Do you offer your heart and soul over to her? He baptized me in the true faith. He is my counselor, my conscience. I do. The only person I truly trust with my soul. 